So we did a neck reset on this 1938 Gibson 00. Just incredible acoustic guitar. We also replaced the bridge. We put we put the original bridge back on it. It had like a it had an aftermarket one that had a different footprint. It was just kind of funny. So we put that back on. The first photo is just the neck being glued in. And that's how you glue in the dovetail and we had to fit it and adjust the angle and get the geometry all right on it. Next photo, we got a piece of rosewood going over the top of this rosewood. In order to pull the neck off, you have to drill a hole behind it to be able to get heat into the dovetail to loosen it up. So that's hiding the hole that we had to drill into the guitar, and that's the safest way to get into it. This is hiding up our damage, so it's, it's, it's filling a hole in that fret slot. Here's the hole, just kind of smoothed out and on its way to disappear. We got the new fret back in, and, and it's, you can see it if you're looking for it. But by the time we polished it up and everything, pretty much disappears. And then we got strings back on, and the job is done. Action on this guitar measured out to be about six and five, which is pretty ideal for like a, a guitarist with a heavy hand, good, good guitar, but it's, it's adjustable now. Uh, it came in at 14 and 14, and that's in 64, and it was basically unplayable. And, you know, gave it its new life, and you can barely tell we were there. Mm -hmm.